second coat on the first five boards still. Gotta be done. Gotta be done. No more electric work. No more painting walls. No more playing around. We hear you, cat. Ta-da! I have to get this stuff done. My hands can taketh no more. I have got three coats on each of these boards. I have now pulled out the tray and a roller for that. I'm gonna get something to put the varathane in and roll that on the other boards. Let me show you the other boards set up because I wanna get 10 done tonight. <laughs> Yay me. Okay. Haven't cleaned up from my electrical work, but that's okay. So then here we have one, two, three, four. I need to bring one more in, but this is gonna be the station for polyurethane. And then over here, which I should switch the two, because trying to paint on plastic is horrible, and sometimes I just paint on the floor because you know, the plastic gets in the way and we don't have time for that. So we just, you know, paint the floor. It's all getting replaced. Um, yeah, that's where we are so far. <laughs> all right, it is the next day. I have the next four boards here. These, um, I think these are the four that I varnished. Should be the ones that I completed are back here I have swept and mopped my floor gotten all the little pieces of toys up where the dog has chewed them up and it was scattered all throughout my house looking horrible anyway we're gonna do a quick haul I needed to go out and get some more tray liners I wanted to get another roller handle so I can have one for the polyurethane, one for the paint. I wanted a small four inch tray. Couldn't find that there. I said I'll check the dollar store. Uh, these are all from Walmart. Got some more um, rollers because eventually I am going to do my doors. But when I walked in, uh, they got me y'all. I couldn't, I couldn't resist. I put my hands on it, I looked at it, I held it, I, I had to have it. It is a wax warmer, and it's going to be perfect with my floors. You put the little wax melts in here, but then it's got a space for little pieces of decor that it comes with. Three little trees, three little pumpkins. It is adorable. I had to have it. 20 bucks, a little bit excessive whatever I got it um then I went over to the dollar store found what I was looking for even comes with more foam rollers four inches dollar 25 get all kinds of stuff with it and they want to charge you a dollar 75 for a a liter of Pepsi you can get a whole two liter for 
$1.25 of Stars and Stripes because I'm stressed. I got a lot to do. And we're just eating and drinking very bad. Also, at Walmart, I wanted to let you know that I found the tack cloth that I was trying to find. Uh, and that's what it looks like. It's just a cheese cloth with like a wax in it. And it helps to get up all the sawdust off after you, you know, sand. It, anybody that has ever painted and primed and gotten things ready for painting, you got to get the... We all know what this is. Everybody knows what this is, except for <laughs> the guy in Ace Hardware. Okay. Back to work. I don't even know if I showed you my setup, but I took my two plywood boards. Excuse me. I took my two plywood boards and I just lay out four or five, whatever, and just brush on the top of the baseboard, the varnish, and then I roll over. And now I'm going to let, <coughs> let these dry. Go put a coat of paint on the ones that were completely varnished last night, come back, sand these, do another coat, and then put them in the other room for painting. So once they're done in this area, we go over to this area where I have one, two, three, four boards prepared for paint and I'm getting ready to do that. All right, time for another haul. It's a different day. The next day probably. Um, and so I, okay, let's just do this. My battery died on my drill. And I don't know where it is. I probably threw it out thinking, I don't know what this goes to. I probably don't have it anymore. Okay. Yeah. Dinner is served. Okay. They didn't have <coughs> my favorite Count Chocula. This will do. Or nannies, they're good for you. Gonna make some chili in the crock pot. Gonna make some chili in the crock pot. Voltage meter because it's a fun tool. And sometimes I question my wires because they did some weird stuff. <laughs> okay. I also bought um, two three-way switches because I've realized in wiring or replacing my two light switches, one at the bottom of the steps, one at the top of the steps. I was like, why does this top one have four wires? And I looked it up on YouTube. When you have a light switch that can be turned on or a light that can be turned on from two different places, you need to do three-way switches. One of those wires is just a transporter to the other switch or something like that. Anyway. Hope you're having a lovely evening. I am going to go eat my cereal and try my lights. All right, these are the types of lighting switches that you have. You have a single pole, okay, which is what this is. You just have one switch in the house for one light, single light, single switch, single pole. This one you have two or more switches, I guess. So you get the three-way switch. A three-way switch allows you to cut a certain light on from here and from somewhere else in the house. 